Well, how much pride do you take in your job? I, I know you're pretty invested, yeah. right? I'll yeah. give you credit for that. Well, the people in our next story, they are on a completely other level. They sure are. Atlanta News First reporter Joshua <laughs> Skinner made a trip to the grocery store this morning to watch some of Georgia's best baggers. On your mark, get set, back. So this is a thing, a really intense thing. We pull from all 182 stores, the best 12. That's the number of finalists for Kroger's Atlanta district. We've been practicing for like a month and a half. The goal is what you see. Bag the groceries as quickly as possible with a horde of screaming fans around you. It blew me away. It was a lot of cheering, a lot of noise. 17-year-old Wyatt Shaner blew away the competition. Is it harder to pack a reusable or a paper bag? I would say paper. I think reusable is pretty easy. He's passionate about this gig. Speed is one thing, but it's also about getting items in there and not crushing anything and make sure your weight's good. And practice makes perfect. Yeah, we were practicing for this the other day and I dropped a jelly on the ground. Had to stop, clean it up, yeah. Regardless of the outcome for the other 11 baggers, they're still some of the best in the state. <laughs> Working at a grocery store as your first job is probably one of the better ones. Wyatt moves on to regionals in Orlando, where he'll compete against baggers from other grocery chains. Winner goes to nationals in Las Vegas. <laughs> Sounds like his kind of bag. A bagging pushing carts, it's awesome. Amongst the throngs, Joshua Skinner. <laughs> Atlanta News First. Yeah, there's a skill to that. There's a competition for everything. Yeah, just don't crush my eggs or my bread, please. Those do not go at the bottom of the bag. They go on the top. <laughs> if I was bagging everything you ordered, I know. That's why I'm like, you're not a bagger. <laughs> you, you've never bagged your own groceries. Anywho. All right. Well, don't.